Happy Friday, everybody. Welcome to The Heather Show. I've got a package I'm super excited to open, like I'm excited to open all of them. Um, this package comes from a company that sells fragile cats. See? Here, look. In shipping, the a package must be upright. You know, we don't want to shake the cat around. It is fragile. There may be broken glass in here with the cat. Um, yes, and handle with care. Then when we open, we cup the kitty's face. Just kidding. <laughs> this came from Strange Cat Toys. Um, I pre-ordered this when it released in February or March. I think it was February or March. And um, it was supposed to be shipped in June. And I just got it like a day or two ago. So <laughs> at least it finally came. Hopefully it's, uh, you know, all intact. So very excited for this one. Um, it is, man, I don't know if I should tell you what it is before I open it. Does that even make sense? I don't know. I wanted to open it so bad. But then, I was like, gotta wait to open the box, Heather. Or else it's just not as exciting. <gasps> Ooh, this is pretty. Okay, so I saw this in a photo of somebody else's that they got. And they sent a, um, I don't know what we'd call this, a clip. A clip for, um anything you want to clip it to. I don't have anything on my cell phone to clip it to. Maybe keys. I am so slow. <laughs> this is probably a key ring. Okay. So that's cool. I like that. Got some paper. We'll recycle this. Very important, everybody. Always, always recycle when you can. Ooh, I got two. All right. So I got a light pink one and a darker pink one. Now that's not what I pre-ordered. I guess they sent that as a gift. So let's do this. All right, so there's two of them. First one I'm gonna take out is a white one. This um, character's name is right here on the package. I don't wanna say it wrong. I'm gonna try to say it, it's probably really wrong. <laughs> it's Umasu, Umasau. I don't know how to say it right, I feel so dumb. Okay. But it's like this little dragon guy, and they have like people faces in it. So it's like a person wearing a dragon suit. And the theme for this series was um, cherry blossoms. And these are made by Leaderworks. I don't even know if I'm saying that right. I feel so bad. But these are so cute. These were pre ordered in February or March. Can't remember. So here's the other one. The other one is pink. We'll take them out of the packages here in a second. But um, what was I going to say about these? These are sold out. If you're super interested and must have one of these, I can only recommend eBay. Um, they don't restock these. These are made in like a thousand pieces, a hundred pieces, whatever it is. It's limited pieces. When they, they sell out, they don't make more. They'll make another design, but not the same ones. So if you need these exact ones, eBay. And they're called Umasu by Literworks. So, um, let's open the white one first. Oh man, these are gorgeous. Very careful. These are um, designer toys. So if you do go on eBay and look these up and you're not a designer toy collector, when they come up for um, a lot of money, don't be shocked. That's what these would go for. Retail, these were $30 a piece. On eBay, they'll probably be double, maybe a little bit more. So... Um, don't freak out. Don't think that that's insane. It is insane, but that's what's going to happen with designer toys. So what I was wondering when I saw the photos of these, and here's a little person in the inside, was if the beads were um, glued in place or if they were going to shake around. So I do think they shake around. They do. And then um, they've got these... Uh, little cherry blossoms on the nose the back of the head even the body 
And I don't know if you can see inside, it's over here. See these little red cherry blossoms in there? Those are actual beads. Those are nice. And um, yeah, they all shake around. So that's the first one. I don't remember if they had names that were different from one another. All I know is that I'm calling them cute. Oh, oh my gosh. Not what you wanna do to a designer today. Do not drop this. Okay, so here's the pink one. You know, when these, they advertise these, I was like, which one do I get? Do I get the pink one or the white one? I never made a decision, so I bought both. Because the same day these were released, here's the little person inside that one, um, they sold out in an hour. So, not as quickly as like the Funko exclusives, you know, nothing like that, but still an hour is pretty quick, you know. If you go to the Funko website and they drop an exclusive, it's gone in like 10 seconds. So this one does, it, this is exactly the same. It's got all the cherry blossoms on its head and its back. Even has the little, the little red ones in here. You can see them better on this side. The little red ones. I wonder why the little dragon's feet are backwards. You see that? Maybe it's because it's a person wearing a dragon costume. So let's let's hold these both up to see if the little people are different. I think the one inside the white one, her hair and her outfit are white. I think these are girls. And in the pink one, her outfit and her hair are pink. And then their little undershorts or shorts or whatever are vice versa. They like are opposite of whatever color they are. So I really, really like these. Um, I've seen a few more drops since, um, a few more different designs drop since I ordered mine. And um, I didn't I didn't jump on them like I did these because uh, these took so long to get here. And it's, it's all because of COVID and um, issues with post offices and stuff. Um, with all the stuff that I do, um, I have noticed that domestic shipping within the US is okay for the most part. Sometimes it gets a little hairy, but um, when I've shipped out of the country, things get stuck in their customs. Like they don't want cooties from the US. So um, I've sent a pa uh, two packages to Canada and um, that's it so far. I have a package that needs to go to China, but um, the post office has warned me, like, if you send it there, it's going to take, like, three months. So I'm just trying to hold on to it and hope that things get better. Um, yeah, and it has nothing to do with the United Postal Service if you're shipping internationally. Our stuff gets to their country, and then it just sits in their customs for however long they want it to sit there. So that's what's happening. Um... If you order things in from other countries, I don't know why. I think they pack it and it goes to their customs and then it just sits there before they send it. So um, that's what's going on. Those are their precautions. I'm not knocking them because they're doing whatever they can to keep their people safe. And we're not. <laughs> so, um, I mean... You could say some people are trying. I don't want to just say nobody's doing absolutely anything. So, um, But this was a video about toys and I just started talking about the post office. So let me know what you think of these. These are very, very cute. Ah! <laughs> these are so cute. Because I got a big head and little arms. Did anybody see that movie? I haven't seen that movie. If you can name that movie. These are really cute. I love these. This little person come out. I don't think we want to try to get the little person out. The little person is nice. They are barefoot. I don't know if there's any other details that I could point out that I haven't already. I just really, really like the paint job. These are awesome. This is going to look great with the rest of my designer toys. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. This is uh, not my typical toy video. You will not ever find these at Target or Walmart or any retail store. I got these from um, Strange Cat Toys. Um, there's another company called Mind's Eye and I heart 
or um, my plastic heart that um, will release um, designer toys from designer companies. They always don't all get the same things from the same designer people, so you're going to want to keep a lookout on all of them. If you have any questions, go ahead and send me a direct message. I love talking about toys and designer stuff and um, giving tips and helping people, so um, just let me know what you think, and these are awesome. These are awesome. I don't know if this is from Leaderworks or if this was like something that Strange Cat did, but these are really cool. Gosh, I don't know what I'm gonna hang from these. I don't know if I wanna hang keys on here because it might make them dirty. It will make them dirty. I don't want them to get dirty because I don't know if you can see it, but they both have the little logo from the figure, the character with some cherry blossoms. I love cherry blossoms, they're so pretty. I went to Washington DC uh, once right after the cherry blossom thing happened. So there were cherry blossoms all over the ground, like dead ones. I never got to see them in full bloom. Um, they don't stay in full bloom for very long. So anyway, thank you for letting me rant on. I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day and awesome weekend. If I don't see you, take care. Ciao.